Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and thank you for tuning in to this episode of the Bradical Radical Show. I'm your host, Bradley, and that's a big tower! Nah. Do we? That's do, the core, yeah. Do we go in there? I think we go under it. But I'm already underground. What's, like, what's under the underground? More underground. Whoa. Ring. <laughs> See that building in the distance? I don't remember if this was your voice or not. It is now. It is now. <laughs> you know what kind of voice this is? You know what kind of voice this is? <laughs> Why? Why do we do this? That's the core. The source. <laughs> I hate you. I can't stop now. <laughs> the source of all the power for the other ground. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. And the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Cool. Thanks, dragon lizard lady person. Oh. What? I, I didn't realize I was right here. Yeah, you're here. <laughs> All right. Cool. <laughs> um, huh. Oh, right. I remember how everything goes. <laughs> Left floor one, right floor two. Let's go to left floor one. Gotta go left before you can go right. Don't mind my coffee chugging. <laughs> What's over here? Have I? Oh, okay. This is outside the lab. Yeah, yeah. What if I go say hi to Asgore? Or, uh, Alphys. Alphys? Uh, she's not in here. I think she's still in the, uh... She's still in the bathroom. In the quote unquote bathroom. <laughs> she's still in there? No, okay, she's not. Is she up here? No. Hello? Hello? Huh. Disappointing. I just want to have friends. Alright, guess we're going to the right side first. Back in the spooky elevator. Oh, cool. It'll take me right over there. So, is this the wonka Vader? Because I'm going between sides, so yeah, clearly yeah. I'm going front ways and back ways. I, and... I imagine you're going down, and then you're going to the side. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm Heat's Flames Man. Remember my name. Remember his name. You gotta remember <coughs> it. Do I have to remember it? Yeah, remember it. Oh. <laughs> it's you. Look, there's snow on the building. <laughs> Yeah. I love hot dogs! I love hot dogs! <laughs> <laughs> That's not the voice that thing makes, right? Is it a weird thing to on that guy's room? You're gonna have to get rid of the sound bite. Cause he's too lazy, he's like, nah! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> toasty bun! Yeah, he's got a toasty bun in his, in his hole. Yeah. Do you see it? Right there. <laughs> He's a volcano. He's got a hot dog coming out of his volcano. Hey, buddy. What's up? Want to buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Sure! Oh, I actually bought it. Yeah. Thanks, kid. Here's your dog. Yeah, dog. Apostrophe dog. It's short for hot dog. How many can you buy? I don't know. A lot. Okay, buy the, fill up your space, and then just buy a bunch of them. Hey, buddy, what's up? Want to buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Sure, another hot dog. Here you go. Whoops. I'm actually out of hot dogs. Here, you can have a hot cat instead. All right. Hey, buddy, what's up? Want to buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Sure, another dog coming right up. You really like hot animals, don't you? <laughs> hey, I'm not judging. <laughs> I'd be out of the job without folks like you. <laughs> It doesn't say hot. Okay, hot dog again. Of <laughs> course. Hey, buddy. What's up? Want to buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Cool. Here's that dog. Apostrophe, apostrophe dog. It's short for apostrophe. Apostrophe <laughs> dog. <laughs> 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 Which is, in turn, short for... Hey, buddy. What's up? Want to buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Another one? Okay, careful. If you eat too many hot dogs, you'll probably get huge like me. Huge isn't super popular, I mean. I'm practically a hot dog tycoon now. Okay, now buy like two more. I'm on it. I gotta use my dimensional no, no, box. Don't, don't use them. Don't use them. But I don't have room. Don't use them. But I don't have room. 
It's only 30G. You're holding too much. Guess I'll just put it on your hat. <laughs> now just keep <laughs> Here's another hot dog. It's on the house. Well, no, it's on you. Here, have fun. Here, have fun. <laughs> yeah, he stops charging you, which is nice of him. <laughs> I know no limits! <laughs> Walking. 30 is just an excessive number. number. 29 now, that's fine, but 30. Doesn't look like my arms can reach that. <laughs> Sorry, 30 isn't the limit on head dogs. Oh, it looks so wrong! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> he lost them all. Here, have fun. <laughs> can you talk to the other people and see what they say or, about your head dogs? We're gonna find out. <laughs> Didn't know I was doing this for the next 30 minutes. <laughs> ah! Here, have fun. I I can't. I can't keep them. Yeah. I'm sure there's a way. Well, you can walk. You can walk down. You just can't go sideways. Is that what it is? I think so. Cause you were walking up and down earlier, and it was fine. <sighs> I mean, you don't have to have a whole head full of them. They don't care. Okay. All right. See you, Sans. Ooh. Right. I forgot how. Industrial. I forgot how awesome the core music was. Mm -hmm. Dinner with the girlfriend. Winky face. It's a picture of a cat girl figuring next to a bowl of instant noodles. Yeah. Same though. Yeah. Cool skeleton 90. <laughs> <laughs> School skeleton 95 posted a picture. Are we posting hot pics? <laughs> no. How do I how do I do papyrus voice? Okay, I'm posting hot pics. I am the great papyrus. Here it is me, my cool friend. It's a picture of papyrus flexing in front of a mirror. He's wearing sunglasses. Giant muscular biceps are pasted on his arms. The biceps are also wearing sunglasses. <laughs> I'll have to post it now. Oh, it, there is a legit picture, isn't there? I, I don't know. Uh, maybe someone made it. I, I picture. think it's a fan art thing, yeah. but and I never realized that's where it's from. <laughs> I'll just update it. Lol, ske cool skeleton died. Lol. Co hmm. There's too Lol. many voices. Lol. Cool skeleton 95. That's a joke, right? Cool skeleton 95. The only joke here is how strong my muscles are. Alright, what's down here? Naps the blue 22. I sent you a friend request. Accept the request? Obviously. It seems I've already rejected this. <laughs> <laughs> no! There's an apron lying on the ground. Will I take it? Sure. I'm carrying too much. I'll eat a hot dog. You eat the hot dog. Your HP is maxed out. I heard a puppers. Puppers? There's an apron lying on the ground. Will you take it? Yeah. You got the stained apron. Who's that from, Em? You know who it's from. Who's it from? Do I know who it's from? No. Yeah. Is it better than cloudy glasses? Uh, the apron... I don't know, you scamps. Remember. I don't remember. Alright. It might do the same thing. It's for the cooking thing, so it might do the same thing in terms of healing items. <laughs> Hi, it's Dr. Alphys. This puzzle is kind of um, timing based. You, you see those switches over there? You'll have to press all three of them within three seconds. I'll try to help you with the rhythm. Okay, now press the third one. Hey, hey, looks like you, you only needed to press two of them. I want to press all three. Watch it turn back on. <laughs> oh boy, this place. Alpha's updated status. That's the last time I tried to help with a puzzle, LMAO. 
Lamau. Uh, hey, I'm going to the bathroom, so I'll be MIA for a bit. Uh, I'm sure you can handle this puzzle yourself. Can I, though? Interesting. Okay, nothing up there. I see. I sees. Hmm. Maybe I don't see. Hold on. There we go. Nope. I wasn't here. We go. I suck. Um. Hmm. Maybe do that and then that. What's up there? Stuff. Go check it. I'm trying. You can. You do that. Now go down. Now go back up. Oh, okay. That way. Now go back over. That, now go down. That. No. Oh, it, it reset. Oh, okay. It resets. Never mind. Yeah. Oh, are you going? I'm going. No, it's not possible to get up there. It's possible to get up there. Because that up arrow is only there. Does it change like it, how the other ones do? Yeah, and it's only there if these are facing the other way. Maybe it's a way to get back down or something. I don't know. I'm pretty sure there's a way up there. It's got to be, right? Tobias Fox will not do such a thing to me. Tobias? I don't know. <laughs> Toby's usually short for Tobias? No, just Toby. Tabantha. Tabantha. Tabatha. Tabatha. I got this. It was odd at some point that I was making it out to be. <laughs> really? Yeah, I just had to go back and then go forward, forward. again. Okay. Uh, resume at about a whatever. Yeah. yeah. A, a, 18, whatever. Yeah, we'll figure that out. OMG, people think Mew Mew 2 is better than Mew Mew 1. <laughs> well, I'll, that's a joke, right? Knowing the mouse might one day hack the computerized safe and get the cheese. It just looks like microwave to me. It fills you with determination. I hope he one day gets that cheese. Does he ever get the cheese? Maybe. Squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak. There's a piece of uh, cheese inside this computerized laser safe. The lasers have melted the edges of the cheese. It's stuck to the table. OMG. Don't don't they get it? It ruins Mew Mew's entire character arc. <laughs> My Mew Mew 2 review. Mew Mew Kissy Cutie 2 is not neither kissy nor cutie. It's trash. Zero stars. Zero stars. <sighs> Must be a Star Wars fan. Hey, you! Stop! Oh, these guys again. I don't remember your voices. We've, like, 
received an anonymous tip about a human wearing a striped shirt. There you go. They told us they were wandering around Hotline right now. I know, sounds scary, huh? Well, just stay chill. We'll bring you someplace safe, okay? All right. <laughs> All right, dudes. Huh? What is it, bro? The shirt they're wearing? Like, what about it? Bro, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Bummer. This is, like, mega embarrassing. We've, like, actually totally had to kill you and stuff. Happens. The Royal Guard attacks. Uh, I'll clean your armor. You attempt to judge RG01's armor. Your hand slips off. <laughs> like, hands off the merch. Team attack. Team attack. Oh god, these guys are pretty tough, actually. I got this. Zero one stands guard. Queen armor? You can know RGO2's armor. It's cool and dirt begins to wash away. Getting warmer. Like, you're dead and all. Ow. Can't take it. <laughs> armor too hot. Armor's oh so my! Hot. See, look at his little fishy scales, though. He is a fishy. Yeah. Much better. Oh. RG01 looks bothered by something. Oh. Baka. <laughs> Whisper. You tell RG01 to be honest with his feelings. I. I. Hmm. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, his. The other ones are, uh. Frantic. <laughs> Dude. I can't. I can't take this anymore. Not like this. Like. O2. I like. I like. Like you, bro. The way you fight, the way you talk. I love doing team attacks with you. I love standing here with you, bouncing and waving our weapons in sync. <laughs> <laughs> o2, I like, want to stay like this forever. Uh, I mean, uh, psych, gotcha, bro, ha <laughs> ha. Oh, one. Y yeah, bro. Do you want to get some ice cream? Do you want to get some ice cream? After this. Sure, dude. <laughs> oh, one and OTR looking at each other happily. You won. Earned zero XP and 100 gold. That is a match made. I'm going to eat another hot dog. What's up here? Oops, wait, how's the human doing? Dang it, Alphys. Top that shows that make you forget to do your frickin' job. <laughs> Alphys, please. Number six might shock you. Number six might shock you. Ring. Okay, I'm back. Another dark room, huh? Don't worry. My hacking skills have got things covered. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, yes! <laughs> Good evening, beauties and gentle beauties. Gentle beauties. Am I a gentle can, beauty? Can I use that from now on as my intro? Beauties and gentle beauties. This is Metaton reporting live from MTT News. Oh, only if uh, it's Undertale related, right? Yes. An interesting situation has arisen in Eastern Hotland. Unfortunately, our correspondent is out there reporting live. Brave correspondent, please find something newsworthy to report. Our ten wonderful viewers are waiting for you. Um... Oh my! It's a completely nondescript glass of water. <laughs> but anything can make a great story with enough spin. Report this one? Eh, we'll look more. Basketball's a blast, isn't it, darling? Too bad you can't play with these ball. <laughs> They're MTT brand fashion basketballs. We're wearing, not playing. You can't get rich and famous like moi without beautifying a few orbs. Report this one? Eh, we'll look more. Dog. What a sensational opportunity for a story! I can see the headline now. A dog exists somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Frankly. <laughs> a dog exists somewhere. I'm blown away. What do you say? <laughs> Frankly, I'm blown away. Oh my, it's a president to dress you, darling. Aren't you just bursting with excitement? What could be inside? Well, no time like the present to find out. Now, what else is around here? Can I leave? Nope. 
Is that a book? Oh la la, this video game you found! It's dynamite! Though I don't make an appearance until in it until three fourths in. But I like that. Appearing from the heavens like Mana? Yeah, Mana. Mana from heaven? You never heard of that? No. Uh. Slack in the audience's hunger for gorgeous robots. Oh, that's Metaton! My god, Brad, read your Bible more. <laughs> you sinful, sinful monster. Oh no, that movie script! How'd that get there? It's a super juicy sneak preview of my latest guarantee not to bomb film. Guaranteed. Metaton, the movie. So that's 10, 20, 5, 6, 7, 8? 28? Starring Mattaton! I've heard that like the other films, it consists mostly of a single four hour sh shot of rose petals showering my reclining body. <laughs> oh, but that's not confirmed. You wouldn't co spoil my movie for everyone with a, a promotional story, would you? Nah. Phew, that was close. You almost gave me a bunch of free advertisement. I'm gonna go report on the dog. This dog still exists! The story just keeps getting better. <laughs> yes. It's you reporting the news. <laughs> it really is. Attention viewers, our correspondent has found a dog! Q audience Oz. That's right, folks. It's the feel good story of the year. Look at its ears. Tiny paws, fluffy tail. Wait a second. That's not a tail. That's. A fuse! <laughs> what? That's right, that dog is a bomb! Aren't they all bombs? Yeah, everything's a bomb. <laughs> Don't panic! You haven't even seen the rest of the room yet. Oh my! <laughs> it seems everything in this area is actually a bomb. <sighs> How do I get out of this again? <laughs> I think you have to defuse each one, and, I, it, and it jumps you into, like, a, a mini encounter. I don't know if I've ever done this correctly. No. <laughs> that present's a bomb! That basketball's a bomb! Even my words are... Ah! Even my words! Brave correspondent, if you don't defuse all the bombs, this big bomb... This big bomb blew you to smithereens in two minutes. <laughs> then you won't be reporting live any longer. How terrible, how disturbing. Our nine viewers are going to love watching this. Good luck, darling. Ring. Don't worry. I installed a bomb diffuser program on your phone. Use the diffuse option when the bomb is in the diffuse zone. Now go get them. All right, doggy. Got him. I think. Okay. Keep heading around the room. Try not. Try to go for the one in the bottom left next. I'm on it. I'm on it. You got this. Oops. Oh no. Oh. I got this. All right, got a minute. Plenty of time. What? Oh yeah, whenever they're faded out, you can just walk right through them. <sighs> ah! Yes. <laughs> oh, so you have to wait for it to go in there? Yeah. Okay. All right, that's three. I see the okay. glass of water flying around everywhere. <laughs> the glass Present. Of water is the hardest. <laughs> I think the water's all that's left. No, the basketball. The basketball. <laughs> Alright, got the basketball. Dude. You got this. Great job. H head for the center. I'm using uh, EM fields to trap the glass water there. <laughs> As you do. EM fields. As you do. <laughs> Up. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Eight seconds! Well done, darling! You've deactivated all of the bombs! If you didn't deactivate them, the big bomb would have exploded in two minutes! Now it won't explode in two minutes! It's it'll explode in two seconds! <laughs> Goodbye, darling! Well, that's unfortunate. Incredible. 
Ah. Uh, uh, it seems the bomb is going off. That's because while you were monologuing, I... I fix... Um, I change... Oh no, you deactivated the bomb with your hacking skills. Yeah, that's what I did. <laughs> Curses! <laughs> it seems I've been foiled again. Curse you, human. Curse you, Dr. Alphys, for helping so much. But I don't curse my eight wonderful viewers for tuning in. <laughs> Until <literally> next time. <laughs> what are we, my streams? Till next time, darling. Wow, we, we really showed him, huh? Hey, I know I was kind of weird at first, but... At first. I really think I'm getting more, uh, more... More confident about guiding you. So, don't worry about that big dumb robot. I'll protect you from him. And if it really came down to it, we could just turn... Um, never mind. Later. <laughs> Can I kick it? <laughs> but where do I go from here? Oh, cool. It's quiet and I don't like that. Ah, there's that creepy core music I love. The creepy core music? Um, I notice you've been kind of quiet. Are you worried about Asgord? Well... Don't worry, okay? The king is a real nice guy. I'm sure you can talk to him, man. Well, if you're a human soul, you can pass through the barrier. So, no worrying, okay? J just forget about it and smile. Yeah, he's a big pushover. He's King Fuzzy Buns. Please select the location. Uh, left floor three? I guess? Onward? Alright, what's out here? <sighs> I forgot about you. You wanna do Muffet's voice for me? Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about her. You want me to do Muffet's voice? Yeah. Welcome to our parlor, dearie. Interested in some spider pastries? All proceeds go to real spiders. Sure. It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. <laughs> Wait, it's just a croissant. <laughs> Alright, guess I'm not buying that. It's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. These are display items, dear. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Buy a spider cider for... <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm good. I'm good, man. Hold on a minute. I still got dog residue. Yeah. I still got dog residue. Are you gonna try to buy it? <laughs> Are we gonna? Okay, so we're gonna cut, right? <laughs> I don't know if I got it in me. You know what though? You have so much extra space that you can like use the dog residue three times. That's not gonna help me. Like you think it will? <laughs> I I ended up buying a donut. I. I didn't want to, but that girl, even though I told her no, she kept staring at me in this creepy way and licking her lips. She's Now I'm out of cash. <laughs> Why are you so expensive? Yeah, I, I don't got that kind of patience. <laughs> I do. I almost want to, though. I want to know what she says. Hi, Alpha's here. This room is like the room we saw before. There are two puzzles in the north and south. You'll have to solve them both to proceed. Now, also, I'd like to say, I don't really like giving away puzzle solutions, but if you need help, just call me, okay? Actually, wait, I have an idea. Let's be friends on Undernet. Undernet? Then you can just ping me when you need help. Wait, we're friends already, aren't we? I signed you up, didn't I? You've been reading my post the whole time. Well, I hope you agree with me about me and you too. She's still there. <sighs> A yawn. <laughs> Can you sell to her? It might sound weird that spiders need donations, but think about it. They have eight feet. That's four pairs of shoes. <laughs> Spider wearing four pairs of pink booties. Aww. Meditate on this image. Meditate on this image. <laughs> 
<laughs> Papyrus turned into my or our uh, sensei. And then um. on this image. <laughs> All right, I gotta look it up now. What? <laughs> no, my phone died. Can you, uh, look, can you look it up for me? Yeah, I can in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta know now if there's if it's worth doing. But hold on. What should I look for specifically? Uh, what happens when you pay the nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine gold to Muffet? Okay. God, don't you just love Muffet? Why am I on can? Oh, God, that's right. Like, why am I on a fandom thing? I was like, oh, I was doing a creepy pasta research. Undertale. What happens when you buy muffets? Oh, okay. Uh, using a spider cider or a donut during the fight ends it immediately. Buying the spider cider from the from her bake sale in Hotland prevents the fight entirely, except in the genocide route. All right. So it's actually more funner if we if, if we don't do anything. If, if we don't do it i know because she she is my favorite fight she's so awesome she's a completely optional boss if you're patient enough you gotta hear that music though i know and, I, and it's just my favorite fight. oh boy I love, I love jumping between the uh, spider silk you know i, I love <laughs> doing that sooner plan attacks not because it's jealous falcon is paying attention to you <laughs> I'm gonna approach the sooner play. You get close to sooner played, but not too close. Not too eh? Close. <laughs> Human? Eh? <laughs> Give me those blushies! The blushies! Vulcan is making coffee and it's crater. Sweet! Alright, get out of here, sooner played. Oh boy. Oh boy. Be nice to me. Vulcan reassures you the plane turning tiny is like completely intentional <laughs> i'm gonna give him a hug you give Vulcan a hug it warms your heart and your whole body ouch your defense drop ah so lovely that's ah you're right yeah <laughs> Vulcan's cheek glow from bright heat all right see ya and let me eat another hot dog Alright, I got one shot. One opportunity. Sees everything I ever wanted. One moment. Hey, I did it. <laughs> do, 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 do. Charge! Hiya, fellas. My favorite Metaton moment. Trademark? <laughs> Trademark? Right. When everything looks the baddest, he poses dramatically, like when he's on the cooking show and the eggs don't turn out right. Is this advice for fighting him? My fave Metaton moment trademarked is when he heats up the heel turning feelings. Oh. Even if it's during that sp. Uh, what? Oh, and I like when he tries on all kinds of different fashionable outfits. Even if it's during what's supposed to be a newscast. <laughs> Fashion show newscast. But then he says, even if you suck at cooking, you can always buy an MTT brand glam burger. Then he eats one. Everyone loves it. How does he eat it without a mouth? Uh, well, watch the show. <laughs> Alright. That guy was like half papyrus. Yeah, yeah. Never maybe, go full. Maybe it was papyrus. <laughs> I mean, he's gotta get away from Undyne somehow. Yeah. And the other guy was probably Sans, because... They like to do stuff together. Oh boy. Oh dear. Ow. I know, that's always hard. How do, how do I? So, um, you can, because you're going in one direction, you just press in the opposite direction and then you hold still. Because you're walking. I tried that. Like that, yeah. I don't know. Ring ring. Ring ring. It, hey, this um, doesn't have anything to do with guiding you, but 
uh, hey, would you want to watch a human TV show together sometime? It's called, um, M Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Sure. No. <laughs> it, really? It's so good. It's, um, my favorite show. It's all about this human girl named Mew Mew, in which she doesn't know she, she's all set to but like, eventually she realizes that her ears sound intact, and that her friends like to spite the ears, and while well, moving, oops, well, which, well, also this sounds weird, but she has the power to control the minds of anyone she kisses, she kisses people and controls them to fix their problems. They don't remember anything after the kiss, I mean, but if she misses the kiss, then, then, uh, and, uh, also, I uh, mean, of course, eventually she realizes that controlling people. Okay, well, I almost spoiled the whole show, but uh, I think you'd really like it. We should watch it after you get through all this. <laughs> <laughs> I'd watch it. It reminds me of a show, an already anime that's out called Data Live, which is interesting. Um, you got this. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can almost do Alpha's fast talking. <laughs> you oh, stopped to smell the flowers. <laughs> you stopped to smell the flowers. <laughs> okay. You gotta sometimes, you know? You just gotta. I eat. Don't let anybody stop you from smelling the flowers, um, guys. I want to go to the right. I messed up. Uh -huh. That's better. Onward. Huh, that's a spooky looking door. Flesh inside. A save point. Yeah. What great luck. The smell of cobwebs fills the air. You're filled with determination. And we will find the source of those cobwebs in the next episode. Why does it seem like this episode wasn't very long? It is 42 minutes. Oh. Uh, took us 42 minutes to get here? Yes. I am slow. Okay. We did but, buy a lot of hot dogs. The hot dogs did, did take a lot of time. <laughs> but thank you all for watching. Yeah. And as always, good night. Enjoy. Be with you all.